Wow, so that was just absolutely horrible. You know, I, I don't know what's worse, a buzzer beater that just rips your heart out at the end or just an embarrassing almost 20-point loss. Final score, 70-51, to 51, so they get it under 20 at least. But after 15-10, to 10, early on the Flyers led 15-10, to 10, and then boom, boom, back-to-back -back threes for Syracuse, took the lead 16-15. to 15. I don't know how many three-point shots they ended up with or how many layups and dunks Dayton missed, but... It just seemed like right when, just right, uh, right there showing a replay of one of the many threes that Syracuse hit. And a typical Syracuse team, they're always going to have some big, long, wiry-ass guys blocking shots, deflecting passes. Of course, the token white guy nailing a couple of three-pointers. And uh, right there he is, showing a, a replay of one of his threes. Boheem. 2-3 zone, all in action. Dayton had looks. You know, they were contested looks, all those missed layups and dunks. But at a certain point, I think it was about with seven and a half minutes to go, they had five points in the second half. Almost 13 minutes, they had five points. Meanwhile, Syracuse had hit at least five three-pointers probably during that span. Malachi Richardson, player of the game. Tough weekend for the Miller Bros. Well, they're not even, they didn't even make it to the weekend. Unbelievable. Well, as a Browns fan, I'm used to this feeling. I thought maybe. I thought maybe we could get by Syracuse. Hell, I was even, I was fired up talking shit about Tom Izzo already. Well, thanks for watching, guys. I'm F Zappa 20. Maybe next year. Maybe next year's when they make that run. Of course, they had to mention there at the end, Archie Miller, one of the most wanted men in college basketball right now as a head coach. Rest in peace, Billy Donlin. Wright State. What a bunch of idiots.